Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. And if you are new, then welcome. My name is Jillian. I'm a stay at home mom to two little ones, and I enjoy doing so many different videos here on my channel. And also, I'm sorry that I haven't been able to get up as many videos as I usually do. As you guys know, these past, I would say, like few weeks, month or two, it has just been a really hard time for me and my family and not to mention we did move and just a bunch of other stuff so I have not been able to record as much as I would like to but I'm going to start recording more and also pre-recording because that really helps. But for today's video it is going to be what's in my kids Easter baskets. So this year I am reusing their Easter baskets that they've had for about I think two years now. My mom actually bought them these baskets and I love them. They're huge and the kids love them, so why buy a new one if they still enjoy these? So this one is my son's, and it's Paw Patrol. I'm not sure what his name is, I think it's Chase. And then for my daughter, she has a Minnie Mouse little Easter basket. And like I said, my mom bought them these, I think, two years ago. So I'm gonna be reusing that. So most of these items are going to be toys that I'm putting into their Easter baskets. They barely have any candy, and that is because they're going to be having Easter egg hunts. They're actually gonna have two Easter egg hunts, and I know they're gonna get a ton of candy from those Easter egg hunts. So I don't want them to have too much candy, so I decided to only put a few items of candy in their basket, and then the rest of the candy will come from their Easter egg hunt. So let's just jump right into the video. So for the first item I'm gonna share with you guys, it is actually one that they're going to be sharing. They only had one left of this toy. If not, I would have bought two, but like I said, they only had one. So this one they are going to share, and it is called Hopper Ball. So it's just a blow up ball, it's blue, and so they can bounce on it. It has a little handle. If they would have had two, I would have got my daughter the pink one and then my son the blue one. They only had one. So I bought this. My daughter and my son both love like hopping around and bouncing. So I thought this would be pretty cool. Although it does say ages six and up and my kids are three and five. My son just turned five. I thought this would still be fun for them and I'll watch them so they don't hurt themselves. But that is the first item that they'll get for Easter. Then if you watched my previous vlog, I think it was my spring Target haul, you would have seen this in it. And it's just these little sticks I'm gonna do for when I do their Easter egg hunt. It's an egg hunt kit. Just a little pack that I'm gonna put in the grass. So the next items that the kids will be receiving in their Easter baskets is chalk set. My kids love chalk and they love bubbles. They love being outside. Found these at Five Below. I thought it was a really good price, only a dollar. So my son has Paw Patrol and it comes with three chalks and then this little jumbo holder so it helps them be able to draw on the sidewalk and also prevent them from scraping their hands and hurting themselves so Paw Patrol for my son and then Peppa Pig for my daughter next is going to be this water wow for my son he's never actually had one of these I've heard so much about them and it's by the brand Melissa and Doug I love that brand so I thought I would try this out and basically you just put water in here and then they can paint on the pictures. So for $4, I thought that would be cute to add in their basket. And I apologize for this lighting. This lighting is going to be going in and out. I'm using natural lighting and the sun keeps on going in and out. Next is going to be another item for my son. It is Paw Patrol. I've never even seen this before either. I thought it was interesting. It's a sparkling scratch and reveal. So he scratches and then it reveals a picture of Paw Patrol. It's only a dollar, so I thought that was cute. Next is going to be for my daughter. I bought her a pair of Peppa Pig socks. If you guys have been watching me for a while, you know she's obsessed with Peppa, so got her these pair of Peppa socks. Also for my daughter, I bought this little wand. Target always has these wands like for Christmas and then for Easter. So I think they also have them for Halloween if I'm not mistaken. But you just bang it like that and it lights up and my daughter likes things like this so I thought this would be cute to put in her Easter basket. Next item is going to be for my son and it is this bug dig kit I bought from Target for three bucks. I thought it was really cute. He basically has to be a little scientist and has to dig in and look for the little bug that's in the center of this little stone. So I thought that would be a fun little activity for him to do. Next is going to be a little painting wooden sign for both the kids. I bought this one for my daughter and then this one for my son. They both really enjoy coloring and painting, so I thought this would be a cute addition to their Easter basket. And I completely forgot that I had bought that first chalk set and I ended up buying these little mini chalk sets from Target as well. So I bought this pink set for my daughter and then this blue one for my son. And these were only a dollar from Target, so I grabbed those. Then for my son, I bought this Hatchimal. He's been really into Hatchimals. I bought him a little set 
for his birthday and he loved it so I thought I would just buy him a little mini one next is going to be bubbles they love bubbles as well so I bought this pink one for my daughter and then this little blue one for my son I think they're so cute and festive especially for summer this one's supposed to be a popsicle and then this one's a little ice cream these are really cute I think I bought these from five below if I'm not mistaken and then next is going to be the candy that I bought them. But like I said, I didn't buy them too much candy just because they will have two Easter egg hunts, which they're going to receive so much candy in those hunts. So the first thing I bought for them is Reese's and these little eggs. And then I bought them both some M&M's. And then I also bought them some Jelly Bellies. And I'm not even sure if my daughter's even going to eat these. She's not a big candy person, which is a good thing. But I bought it, and now I'm thinking I'm not sure if she's going to eat it. But I bought that for her. And then for my son, I bought Skittles with the little Easter ears on top. So that was cute. And then the rest are going is going to be like all the eggs that I bought for them. I also did buy this sticker set so I can put into their eggs when we have the Easter egg hunt. So it comes with over 200 stickers in here. So I thought I can cut them up and put them in their eggs. Another item I bought for their eggs is these little stamps I bought from Dollar Tree. And I still need to go buy some more stuff to put in their Easter eggs, but those are the two items I have already to put in their eggs. And then I bought just some grass for their Easter baskets. So I bought two packs. Oh, I also found at Target these little cute little Easter totes. I thought it was really cute. I don't know what I'm going to stuff in here, but maybe I'll stuff one of their toys or even all their little snacks just since I didn't buy too much candy. And I bought the blue one for my son, the pink one for my daughter. And then for the eggs, these are the eggs that I bought. And they're so cute. So I bought all of these from Dollar Tree. If you guys have not checked out your Dollar Tree, definitely go check out your Dollar Tree. They have so many cute Easter stuff, especially eggs you guys can find so many great deals so this one is in a three pack and it is little carrots next is going to be these little chicks also in another three pack and i also bought these with really cute designs all over them and this one is a eight pack and then the last pack i bought are these glittery ones i love these glittery ones they're so cute so this one comes with 10 has a bunch of different colors and glitter. I might go back for another pack of these. And then for eggs, it'll be done for eggs. And then I'll probably just throw in some eggs from last year. I have some leftovers from last year that I'll throw into their Easter egg hunt. And then on top of that, my friend will be joining us for the Easter egg hunt. And she'll be bringing some eggs as well. So the kids will have a ton of eggs. That is going to end what I'm putting in my kids' Easter baskets. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, please remember to give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, I would love if you would hit that subscribe button. Join me and my YouTube family. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.